toes Mix the potion Mix it up, girl, put it in motion guys this is rama i recently visited london and i had such a chill time pardon me i didn't film my video in landscape because i wasn't a youtuber at the time okay <laughs> yeah so my sister hit me up she was looking for fun activities to do whilst she's in london and once i was putting her itinerary together i'm like no this is something that i could actually put together and make content out of you never know who needs this information so enjoy stick and stay with me don't go anywhere okay let's tall landing together through my lens We are in London now and the queue at the airport was crazy but we finally made it and we are in an Uber straight to our hotel. That's the National History Museum. Oh, I see. That's so beautiful. Yeah, it looks like the one in... I actually think the taxi was a bad idea because when we got to our hotel it was like 90 pounds but at the airport we checked uber and it was 60 pounds so kindly take note when you get to the airport please take an uber okay so you can save some coins guys so this is a very failed attempt to give you a room tour i actually took this video when we were leaving and i wanted a memory of the vibe but the hotel was very lush after i settled in i stepped out to get some good food I stayed at um, Hampton by Hilton which is located in a great area it gives you access to many restaurants and many of the tourist attractions which is very cool for a tourist so look out for that guys so this is the next day we came down for breakfast and the next plan was to just um go around and do some window shopping i always do some window shopping before i do my main shopping but 
I couldn't help myself. I did a little bit of shopping as a business owner, you know. Shopping is always on the table. I got some few stuff and um, we decided to take a walk around the hotel. Good morning guys, it's a new day in London and today is packed with sightseeing tour bars where we get to see and experience the best of London's famous landmarks. So as usual, we went down for breakfast and we got into an Uber ready to explore this beautiful city. So this big bus tour typically takes you to all the major um, attractions in London like the Beckingham Palace, the Tower Bridge, Tower of London, the London Eye, St Paul's Cathedral, London Bridge, um, Oxford Street, British Museum, like all the major places in London. Currently, we are at the Beckingham Palace, which is the official residence of the British monarch. I was lucky to witness the changing of the gas ceremony. I couldn't find a clip of it, but yeah, it happens every day at 11 a.m. And it was cute. Please note that the location and stops may vary. I recommend that you check with the big bus tour company that you decide to use for their latest updates and schedules, okay? Guys, in between stops, I tried to quickly do some shopping for my customers back home in Ghana. If you are new here, I own a shop, a boutique in Ghana where I sell intimate um, wares. So I quickly had to pass by to um, H&M, Victoria's Secret, um, M&X and other shops on the Oxford Street just to grab something for my customers back home. The name of my boutique is Girl Hub. You can find us on Instagram, on Facebook, everywhere in general, okay? The only lingerie shop that went to MIT and Yale. Yes, we are not playing. <laughs> so if you're in Ghana or if you find yourself in Ghana and you're looking for sexy lingerie or something to spice your marriage, Girl Hub is the place. So after a little bit of shopping, I quickly go back on to the tour bars to continue the tour.
my favorite activity today aside shopping is the landing city cruise where i get to enjoy the stunning views of the city it's free of charge to go to the the sky garden so the left hand side we have the tallest building in western europe i'm sure you've seen it throughout london we're looking at the shard and uh, the shard stands above us at 450 feet high it takes half an hour to go around what oh, just five pound each I think five pounds for live entertainment in London, very, very reasonable price. Probably spend about five pounds on a bottle of beer on this boat. It's across at once. This bridge is starting to swing from side to side. Opened on a Saturday morning in the millennium year. Given very loosely, apparently we sold it. Given to us 200 years ago to celebrate. And that building houses the five star horse guards hotel. London's top tourist attraction, the London Eye, 450 feet high. It takes half an hour to go around. One trip on the London Eye will cost you about £30 each. And since opening the London Eye... Today's activity is more and more shopping, shopping, shopping. You know, as a business owner, shopping is always on the table. Hmm? always on the table so we are going to zara we'll go to we'll go back to h m we'll go back to victoria secret um we are going to all the shops on oxford street to see what i can get for my boutique in ghana girl hub I was very happy i came at a time where they were having sales so wow look at this beauty yay there's a type of lingerie you wear when you are trying to seduce and tease like you know <laughs> so i got um all my items for half the price also and i was so thankful for that because you know the pound and the ghana cds they, they are not i don't know they are they are not friendly like <laughs> the pound is not friendly when it comes to doing business so i was very happy for that
Hi guys, it's another beautiful day in the city of London and today we are going to experience the cable car docks. I don't know if that is what it's called but you see in a minute, you see? This is what we are going to do. Then those that thing you see on your screen, that is what we are going to do. Yay, yay, yay. The cable car docks offers an amazing view over the O2 arena. Like I was trailing to see the city from um, very high up. And if you find yourself in London, this is a must do activity for you. Trust me, you will not regret it. Like it's, it was fun. So this is how it goes. You go, it takes you to one point and then it brings you back to where you started off. So that is what we are going to do. Enjoy. I hope you enjoy the views as much as I did. <laughs> This way. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Up here. You've arrived at your destination. <laughs> overall my trip to london was an incredible one and i cannot wait to go back this city truly has something for everyone and i'm glad i had the opportunity to experience it so if you are planning to go to london i hope my content was um helps you plan your trip do all to subscribe to my youtube channel for more exciting content like this one if you haven't already bye